Yo, what is going on guys? Welcome back to another video and today we will be showing you how to get any DLC camo in Black Ops 3 multiplayer public matches. Also, I'm sorry it is like 6 a.m. when I'm recording this video because I stayed up all night and uh, well, the birds are chirping outside. I apologize. Also, my last glitch video, um, there's a whole thing going on. It only works on PC apparently. I've been seeing it in a lot of the comments because the people that, are, that have a PC, I've seen that are doing it perfectly fine but from what i've seen all of the console players are just saying that it's not possible so i'm sorry to all the console players i guess it's been patched i've changed that title in the description i'm sorry i really do apologize but anyway let's get right into the video for this once again you'll need the pc version unfortunately because this one will actually require you to get a mod from the black ops 3 workshop so you can just go manually go to the workshop and download this mod called the weapon kits plus mod or you can just click the top link in the description but if you're gonna do it yourself just it's called weapon kits plus okay so you're just gonna go ahead and search that up and you're gonna subscribe to it or download it whatever you're gonna call it and then once that's downloaded you're gonna launch up your black ops 3 once black ops 3 is loaded click mods and load up the weapon kits mod once the mod is completely loaded go into multiplayer and then hit the pause button go into gunsmith and create a variant for whatever gun you you want to have the camo on. For this, I'm using the KN44, so I create a new variant and then I go into camos. This mod essentially allows you to have a lot of camos that you normally wouldn't actually be able to have in the game. Like, you have some custom ones in there. Um, you, you can basically do whatever you want. By the way, the black market camos are in the extra camos tab, and the other camos, such as like the pack a punch camos, will be in the zombies tab. The multiplayer tab will just have the normal multiplayer camos and the campaign, once again, just the normal campaign. So there's no point in going in there. But the zombies tab actually has the world at war pack a punch camo in there if you want to use it. Like that is just crazy cool to me that you can just play with a world at war pack a punch camo in multiplayer. I don't know. If you if you're a zombies fan, you'll you'll know what I'm talking about. Anyways, once you pick your camo, simply save the variant and go back to the main menu. Unload the mod and from here go back into multiplayer, then public match and then create a class. Select the gun that you created the variant for and then hit the variant that you created. Once you do this, you should have that camo on your gun. Now, to show you that this actually works in game. Also, just saying, I suck at multiplayer. Getting gameplay for this was just painful. I played one game and I was like, oh my god, I'm terrible. That should be enough gameplay anyway. But I'll always suck at multiplayer, I mean, to be honest. So try not to roast me too hard down in the comments, but um, yeah. Also, later in the gameplay, I switched to a VMP with an Origins Pack-A-Punch camo, which can also be found in the Zombies tab. And I did that when I was testing out if the glitch worked so you can also do that i just did the kn44 for the tutorial but if you want you can do all the guns with the same camo if you really wanted you just need the time to do that which you know it would take like 20 minutes total of your time so anyway that's literally just how to do it that's simple as that you can go into a game you can use all your camos that you selected for that gunsmith class. And if you're on PC, this will 100% work for you. Just, you have to have that mod. It's the specific mod. It won't just be some random mod. Gotta have the very specific one called, or weapon kits plus, plus, sorry. But anyway, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you did enjoy, please do leave a like. If it did help you, please do leave a like. You can sub, you could drop a comment in the comment sections down below if you'd like some more of these types of videos. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next yeah. one. Peace out. I ain't here for the